During the time of the Emperor, Lumia was a beautiful and peaceful kingdom. But some Lumens chose to ignore the great Emperor's laws and went their own way. Soon after this, the darkness came. Seeing this, the Emperor sent his son, the Prince, to save our kingdom. But the evil Zordok had him murdered in the dark wood. Kina and I narrowly escaped with our lives and the awful truth. We feared all of Lumia would be lost. But the Emperor had a plan, for the Prince himself appeared to us no longer dead, but alive. That day changed our lives forever and was the beginning of our kingdom adventure. Okay, guys, let's try that new song again. Hit it! Special command performance for the princess tonight. <laughs> Boy, the boss is going all out to impress the princess. <laughs> but I think it will take more than a concert for the princess to fall in love with him. <laughs> Go, if that was what you said. <laughs> Everything must be perfect tonight at the concert, Gorf. I aim to please the princess. Right, boss. Looks like you can do some aiming yourself, Gorf. <laughs> Hammer the poster, not your thumb, you bramble brain. Remember, I don't want any mess-ups. Now hurry with the rest of those posters. I want them all up by lunch. Yeah, right, boss. <laughs> I didn't know he could sing. Get down, Gore. He's got soul, boys. I didn't know he had it in him. Okay, look, guys, let's try it again. And this time, put a little soul into it, like Gorf, okay? That was great. Let's take a break. Yeah. I know you guys are members of the ancient order of mosquito bites and everything, but, well, I have to level with you. Don't you think that all these rules you follow are just a little weird? You guys are so serious all the time. You never have any fun. Huh. Now, let me get this straight. You're not allowed to speak, right? And you're not allowed to laugh. <sighs> what kind of weirdo makes up rules like that anyways? Oh, man. <laughs> Never laugh or talk. It's probably a crime to smile. Lumen, that's just crazy. <clears throat> it's called discipline, Vibes. Mm, what? Uh, a virtue that you would know nothing about. Members of the ancient order of mosquito brights strive to maintain a constant aura of peace and quiet. They have taken a vow to never speak or laugh. They live in a world of peaceful meditation, deep thought, and quiet. It's the way the Emperor intended Lumens to behave. But these guys have soul power, just waiting to be unleashed. Quite frankly, Vibes, I find the activity in which you have them engaged, this, this, this music, it's deplorable. If not for pits ordering my cooperation, they would never perform with the likes of you in this, uh, what do you call it, uh, band. Wait a minute. If the Emperor likes things so peaceful and quiet, why do you invent music and instruments? Hmm, his ways are at times a mystery to me, I must admit. And besides, 
It's impossible to live your whole life never laughing or talking or singing. Not with discipline and self-control vibes. A true mosquito bite would never engage in something frivolous such as joking or laughter. Uh, come on. Everyone laughs. Let me try one good knee slapper joke and your mosquito bites will crumble with laughter. They're only lumen, Lividia. Hmm. Oh. Oh, very well. See for yourself. Okay. Um, mosquito bites, remember your discipline. You are not so much as to smile. Show vibes you are true members of the order of mosquito bites. Come here, guys. Listen to this one. If I had to live like a mosquito bite, <laughs> it wouldn't matter to me if I live or die. Get it? Live or die? <laughs> <laughs> Silence! Wipe those silly grins off your faces. What did you say to them? No big deal. I just said that if I had to live like mosquito bite, it wouldn't matter to me if I live or die. <laughs> Get it? Live or die? <laughs> <laughs> you are mosquito bites. You do not laugh. Remember your discipline. My. My. Mm. Cheer up, Lividia. Laughter is good medicine for the heart. It seems I've got some work to do. <laughs> mm. <sighs> Beautiful. Just like the princess. I hope that she likes them. Hi, Kina. What are you doing? I'm picking flowers for the princess. Oh. I'm going to give them to her later at the concert. You're going to give her the flowers? Uh-huh. I just wanted to do something special. After all, the concert is in her honor. Do you think I should give her something, too? You can if you'd like to, Lolly. But, but what could I give a, a princess? I'm sure whatever you think of will be very lovely. Hmm, let me think. A special gift for our princess. Well, mm -hmm. maybe I could like make her like a... <laughs> Dagger, transform at once. Right away, your evil lust. Ah. Yes, your evil lust. Uh, I have a mission for you. For me? Pitts has arranged for a special concert for the princess oh. tonight. And you will deliver this music box to her as a gift. A music box? Gosh, I love... Stop! Oh, oh, you must not open it. Oh. This special gift is only for the princess. Right. When she lifts the lid, my special snooze dust will cause her to fall into a deep, dark sleep. Right. A sleep <laughs> that only I will be able to awaken her from. Those lumens will have no choice but to bring her to me. And when they do, she will be mine for good. Now go! Right. Anything you say, your evilness? What a dark mind! You're brilliant! Brilliant, your <laughs> evilness! <laughs> Dagger, do not fail me this Dagger, time. Your evilness? I will! I mean, I won't, your evilness! <laughs> oh, this is great! I love the Master Zordok! Look, Livadai, it doesn't take you any special discipline to be silent. Uh, anyone can do it. Not anyone vibes. Take you, for example. I'm sure someone with your lack of discipline would find it difficult to remain silent for even a few minutes. Oh, really? Well, I'll make you a deal. I'll remain silent until the princess's concert later today. And if I do, you give my friends in the band here a break from this silent stuff and let them live a little. Very well, then. I will allow Mosquito Bites the liberty of speaking three words each. Three words? Whoa, that's real big of you. Three whole words. Sure you're not overdoing it? Do you think I might be? No, 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 no. I, I mean, okay, I'll accept the challenge for the boys in the band here. You've got yourself a deal. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm. my, my, what have I done? <laughs> Huh. Mm. Ah. Huh. Uh. These things are heavy. Uh. Uh. Ow. 
Oh, Vibes, where do you want these banners put? Uh, where? Mm. Over there? You mean here? Uh, well, why didn't you just say so? Hey, Vibes, I hear Pitts is going all out to impress the princess. Do you think she'll be impressed? With Magistrate Pitts? Nah. nah. The princess <laughs> waits only for her prince, doesn't she, Vibes? You may be waiting just as long for an answer from Vibes, Kina. Huh? I think he's forgotten how to talk. <laughs> oh, God. Vibes, I must admit, I've never seen you so quiet. Are you feeling all right? <gasps> you don't have a sore throat or anything, do you? You might catch it. Vibes, is there anything we can do? Why are you pointing to yourself? You want to go into the castle? Uh, no? Gee, are you not feeling well? Gosh, I'm awfully sorry you're not feeling well. Uh, what with the princess concert tonight and everything? I don't think he means himself, Naps. I think he's talking about someone else. Maybe he thinks you're sick, Vogel. No, not me. Well, I'm not sick. I'm in perfect condition. Us guards gotta stay in shape, you know. Gee, Vibes, I sure wish you hadn't made that deal with Livadiah. I can't figure out what you're trying to tell us. Deal? What deal? What's the deal Vibes made with the High Advisor? Oh, it's only that Vibes agreed not to say a word until the concert tonight. He wants to prove to Livadiah he has discipline. If he makes it, Livadiah is going to let the mosquito bites talk. Oh. Vibes not talk? Why? Well, see. Do it. Sure he will. Vibes can do it. Well, we'll see. Even the birds know his name. All that they sing is about him. to keep us apart Never will enter my heart I'll sing my song and pray My love, the prince, will come Oh, I don't know how Magistrate Pitts is expecting me to be cheerful when all I can think of is my love for the prince. Somehow I feel closer to him when I sing. I know you can hear me, and I love you, my prince. You are forever in my dreams. <laughs> I love you, my prince. I love you. <laughs> well, in no time at all, you'll be dreaming sweet dreams, princess. <laughs> but when you wake up, it won't be your precious prince, you'll see. <laughs> Oh, Zordok was going to love this one. <laughs> this moment, I can hardly Isn't wait. Oh, I know. This is gonna be I'm cool. so excited. Oh, and look, here oh, they right. come. Let's get on with it. Lumens of Lumia announcing the Chief Magistrate Pitts. My loyal and lowly Lumen subjects, I hope you will enjoy this wondrous music concert. <laughs> I'm just too good to be true. <laughs> this particular celebration of celebrations is not in my honor, as you might have guessed, but in honor of our own dear precious princess. Just a small token of my affection, love, and devotion to her. Yeah. Let the melodies begin. Yay! 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 Okay, Mosquito Bites, hit it!
that just arrived. Why does he look so familiar? I don't know, Polkum. I think I've seen him somewhere before, too. <gasps> Very nice. If you like that, my sweet, wait until you hear the song I'm about to sing. I wrote it just for you. <laughs> sing? Did you say sing? Just play, minstrel. Okay. <clears throat> You're sweet as much berry pie. Cuter than snuffers, I find you. Princess, I just want to say, would you be mine tonight? <laughs> there, wasn't that lovely, dear? Would you like to hit it again? Yeah. Oh, but it was sure lovely, Pitts. Thank you. Now, as I understand it, some of my lowly Lumen subjects also brought you gifts, my dear. Chief Magistrate, sir, I have a gift for the princess. Well, bring it along, then. Uh, hurry now. There. Why, Kena, how lovely. They're beautiful. What a thoughtful gift. We love you, princess. I thought that these trillies, the Emperor's flowers, would remind you of the prince. Oh, my turn, my turn! Princess! Princess, yes? I brought a gift too! Oh. It's a it's a beautiful patchwork pillow! I made it myself! Do you oh. like it, Princess? Why? You no. can put it on your bed if you want That's to. That's very lovely. Wow, just right, pets. I do have brought a gift! And if you would Where did he come to, from? I'd like to bring I'm not that sure. He looks pretty important. I know I've seen that lumen somewhere before. Ah, but where? Magistrate Pet, oh. sir. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Sir Dagger. I come from a kingdom far away with a very special gift for the lumen most loved in all of Lumia. Most loved Lumen? Yes. In all of Lumia, you say? Yes, that's oh right. My. He must be talking about me. <laughs> Magistrate Pitts, this priceless music box has been specially designed for the Lumen nice. all of Lumia adores. Oh, yes. go on, go on. Something's not right here, Kina. Oh, I know what you mean, Polkum. Pitts actually thinks that Sir Daga is talking about him. That gift is for the princess. No, that's not what I meant. What? A lumen with eyes so fair and cheeks so rosy and hair that is softer than the sun. Huh? Mrs. Like so. Dagger, it is rare that we at Lumia Castle are entertained by someone of your great taste and insight. Oh, why, thank you, Sir But you Dagger. are embarrassing me, saying such nice things about me, even though I what? know they are true. <laughs> what? What? Sorry, Princess, this gift is for me. Uh, but, After uh, all, it is true there is none more loved in all of Lumia than I. But, Sir Dagger. Dagger, uh, Kina, uh, it's Dagger. Uh, oh, Pokemon, uh, he must be after uh, the princess. Uh, oh. <gasps> I wasn't the exactly music box. Oh, well, let's have a look I... then. Give it to me. But, oh, uh, wait. Pits, oh. Pits, wait a minute. Yes. Wait, wait, don't wait. give. The... I, no, but, but, don't open. But, no. Pits, uh, uh, you're, you're not going to uh, open it. Are you? Well, don't be ridiculous. Of course I'm going to open it. It is my gift. Well, now, isn't this lovely? Oh, no. Oh, oh, no. The boss isn't going to be very Get happy going. with this. Get going. Get going. Get lost. Magistrate. 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 No, no. It's no time to go to sleep. <laughs> Punch is over, Wake I up, guess. <laughs> Wake up, wow. Magistrate Pants! Wake up! Uh, I can't believe this is happening! Uh, uh, 
Zordok is not going to like this. If you ever wake up, Pitts, I suggest you try losing a little extra weight. What a cow! Oh, luminous outfit, so pitchy. I'll just oh, he has returned finally. At last, the princess is mine. And then Lumia. And finally, I'll be rid of the Emperor's Prince. Oh, oh, you stay there. Dagger, where is the princess? Bring her to me. Um, your evilness. Things didn't go quite as smoothly as I had hoped. What do you uh, mean? I took the music box, just like you said, Master. But somehow, Pitts thought the gift was for him. And, well, like, uh, he took it, you see, well, and, uh, uh, yeah. What happened? Out with it, Buzzard Bee. Uh, uh, well, it was all a big mistake. Um, uh, well, you see, Pitts, uh, he kind of, well, Sir Zordok, um, Pitts opened the music box, um, by mistake. You uh, what? Uh, oh, oh, how could you let this happen? Uh, oh, oh, oh. Oh. It was an accident, your evilness. An accident? You fool, do you realize what you have done? The only way to wake that slumbering idiot is with a kiss from me. Master, <sighs> there must be some other way. You're evilness. Oh, oh, oh. Silence. Leave at once. Yes, you're evilist. Right away. Oh, oh. Cover up old bits, baby. <laughs> Hate to be in his shoes when he wakes up. <laughs> Maybe I should let you sleep for a few thousand years. The thought of kissing those flabby lips is disgusting. <laughs> Livadiah, there you are. I've been looking for you everywhere. Great concert, wasn't it? This has been a most unusual celebration, with strange visitors and Magistrate Pitts falling asleep at his own celebration, and you, Vice, yes? holding your tongue for the better part of the day. All kinds of surprises. Well, good night, Vibes. Wait a second, Livadiah. Hmm? Aren't you forgetting something? What about our deal? Oh, yes, our deal. Very well. You have won. I will allow the mosquito bites to speak three words. Three words, and that is all from each of you. Liberia is cold. Food is bad. Bed is hard. You see what I mean? <laughs> complaints, complaints. All I ever hear from them is complaints. <laughs> <laughs> oh, never die. You're too much. <laughs> Magistrate Pitts, you're back. Out of my way, minstrel. Oh, what's the matter, Pitsy? Wake up on the wrong side of the forest? <laughs> I don't know what happened. It was the worst nightmare I've ever had. I dreamed I was being kissed by, uh, uh, well, well, well never mind. <laughs> this has been quite a day. Quite a day indeed. 